Hey, hey, YouTube family. How you doing? This is Rhonda with Rhonda Loves Life. Thanks for joining me. All right, guys, I have a quick, uh, quick video of uh, several Nigerian women. I guess they're on this panel and they have a message for Miss Meghan Markle. They are not happy at all with Meghan Markle's cosplay, pretending now that she's 43% Nigerian. When, uh, before she met Harry, I heard that she claimed she was uh, uh, Malta of Malta descent. So, and then on her CV, she says she's 100% Caucasian. So, hmm, things that make you go, hmm. So check out what the uh, the ladies from Nigeria have to say about Miss Megan Markle. Here, the words come directly from their mouth, not ours. So check it out. And thanks for watching. Is there any part of Meg, this 43% that may have preempted you that she's Nigerian before now? Has any of her actions displayed besides the main thing to say, ah, oh, this is a black, this is a Nigerian action? I feel like <laughs> she's going to add to the negative list that we already have in Nigeria. For example, do you say Duchess of, what is it called? Duchess Sussex. 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 Sussex, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, she, she, she's been branded different names. And then she's going to add to the list of we are, we are, we are, we are known to be uh, uh, terrorists, 419, whatever. <laughs> and now she's come to join the list of that. Uh, you know, Brazilian Megan, that they call her. She, she comes in with a, with a diva <laughs> attitude <laughs> and all the rest. No, I don't, I'm not... Proud. You're not but, proud, but rather I'm more, I'm more curious as to why she chose to be a Nigerian. You know, I, I like her for who she is, but she hasn't added value to Nigeria as a country. You know, I, I'm actually I'm more interested in what this DNA thing that they said they did that she's 43 percent. I mean, I don't know. I don't I don't trust it unless I am convinced. <laughs> I was really shocked. I was like, you know, why Nigerian? You know, mm -hmm. out of all uh, states or country, she chose Nigeria. Nigeria. And how far is that true that she is actually mm -hmm. a, is it Nigerian? Forty what percent? Forty three percent. Forty three percent. I don't understand. You, you know. You want to see the proof? You yes. <laughs> definitely. Okay. Our actions tells me she's not a Nigerian. For example, if a Nigerian girl but lucky enough or whatever, marry into the royal family, I think she would know what to do. I think she would have respected her in-laws because that's the way we were cultured. We have aunties, uncle, we have extended family. She would have respected her extended family. And before you know, a Nigerian woman would have earned the, the queen's love and respect that she would start cooking jollof rice within the royal families. And I believe the queen would have been eating Jollof right before she passed away. And that would have been better for that her. Would have, that, then I would have known she's a Nigerian yeah. woman. In all of the things that she has done, nothing. The only thing that I could say probably linked her to a Nigeria is that she looked pretty like Nigerian women. Oh, That's, this right. Is <laughs> That's right. She looked pretty yeah, like a Nigerian she's, woman. She's, she's, and she has a sense of fashion like mm, a Nigerian woman. Sure. Other than that, in terms of mannerism, she's completely zero. You don't approve of her... Actions, even when she's trying to explain that that is tough here, you think a Nigerian woman would have handled it differently? Oh yes, yes, they will handle it differently. I mean, we're talking about who your family is big, yeah. you know, it's culture. She needed to actually back down and just kind of like you know flow with whatever because all those things she put out there, they were all negatives about the royal family. I mean, you coming out there to just damage the royal family like that, and then you think you know, everything is fine. And then all of a sudden you're saying you're Nigerian. No, you're not Nigerian because mm -hmm. we have wives who are married to um, um, princes in, in Nigeria and they don't act this way. Like no. um, um, uh, Mr. Duke right, rightfully said, they, they respect. We are very cultured. We mm -hmm. respect. We are mannered. Mm -hmm. We respect our husbands mm -hmm. and everything. Even if the husband has yeah. said, oh, I'm taking you out. I don't want to have real duties anymore and everything. As a woman, she is meant to be telling Harry to say no. No, because they're all going to think it's me. Yeah. Please, let's, we can let's, work it out. We absolutely. can do this, we can do that. Absolutely. But she didn't. Instead, she ran over there. And now she's saying she's what? Nigerian? No, you're no, not. No, she's not. <laughs> no, she's not. I think she went into the royal family thinking she's going to change mm. the narrative. And then um, it just didn't work. No. And she did not want to work with the people in the palace. She was mm. fighting with Catherine. Mm -hmm. Nothing was good enough no, for her. For her. She should be proud 
they even accepted yes. you to come yes. into the as a divorcee. Yes, because <laughs> when she was in the palace, yeah. she could have said she was in Nigeria. Then we, she could have invited us to the palace yes, to yes, give us some yes. advice, give us some coaching, yes. some Nigeria coaching. <laughs> yeah. How we behave in Nigeria, yeah. how we respect our in-laws and stuff like that. <laughs> now that she thinks that she is a Nigerian, the only advice I would give to her is she needs to go to Nigeria and learn some manners. Well, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> she needs to go to Nigeria and learn some Nigerian manners. <laughs> Just yeah, if she was in a palace, yeah. I mean, yeah. yes, then, yeah. then, and then she proclaimed that she's Nigerian, Nigeria. then maybe she would have gone to the, you know, uh, what's it called now, our royals back home to sit with the wives and let them give us some coaching yeah. on how yeah. to actually conduct yourself as a royal yeah. wife.